Hello everyone, in today's video we will be still playing Ultimate Champion with this new deck I created half an hour ago. It's this giant scaly loon deck. I just put recruits because I feel like it and it's working like a charm so I will show you some games with it. Alright, so we are in the first match. Uh, the opponent had a top 500 badge so that's really promising. We don't have the best starting hand so... I would rather wait for the opponent to do something or maybe just cycle a snowball. That's like the best thing I can do. I don't want to cycle a wizard or a loon for sure. Or maybe... <laughs> Balloon on the bridge. He uses goblins, so he also he didn't have like, the best hand. Oh yeah, I tried to do a snowball predict, but it didn't work out. Oh my god, I hate Goblin Hut so much. Luckily, it's getting nerfed. Like, in half a second, there were six or seven Spear Goblins on the field. Like, it doesn't make sense. So, yeah. Luckily, it will get nerfed soon. Uh, probably, we are playing against the... Oh, actually, we are not. I thought we were playing against a Graveyard, but it's actually a Hog Rider deck. Which is interesting. Um, yeah. Apparently now Goblin Hut is also played with Hog Rider, like doesn't surprise me. But yeah, he has also Monk. Probably the recruits on the right side should take care of it, more or less. Um, I don't want to use anything else for now. Um, he can maybe pressure on the other side to find out if he has uh, any other air counters. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we lost. We can use a Jane Skelly last second. All right, we did not lose yet, but uh, it didn't work out for us that well, to be honest. Um, those spear goblins should die from the bomb. One survives. Um, I'm not sure what big spells he has, so I don't know if I can use my wizard or not. Probably not in the same lane of the monk. This isn't the, a great idea. Let's just pressure. All right, so he has earthquake. The mask should die. The Spear Goblins also die, that's great. Um, I will just go with Recruits, that's a really bad timing. Um, we are really low on the right tower. I'm not sure if we can make something happen here. Let's try going in the other lane. Let's see if it works out. The Musketeer dies, actually. Wait. Wait, let's go, easy win, first game won, like, it was not even close, to be honest. Uh, what were you thinking? Let's jump into the second game straight away, let's not wait any further. The opponent wishes us good luck, let's wish him good luck. Uh, this was a weird tornado placement, only because I saw a tricky goblin barrel for a second. Because I wasn't looking at the screen, to be fair, but yeah, let's just not talk about that. Those recruits also were really random. Let's not talk about that either. At least the Mighty Miner dies and we don't have to think about it anymore. So yeah, we are playing against some kind of Logbait deck. Let's see if he has a Rocket or not. Um, he doesn't have Mighty Miner in hand, which maybe allows me to play a, a really aggressive um, Giant Skelly. Maybe giant snowball predict or, some, or something. <laughs> we didn't predict much. Oh, okay, so he's back to mighty miner. But it should be dead, so... Actually, it ran away last second. Here he will cannon probably, but it will be a really late cannon. Oh, he actually rockets, but it's a late rocket, so we actually get a hit on the tower, which is really great. Let's see. Let's just recruit from the back. 
maybe goblins ready for the princess which I'm expecting but he doesn't play um, thanks to that balloon we are actually kind of back in the game kind of um, let's just go back here I'm pretty sure he won't rocket because why would he want to do that uh, we know that like he knows I have loon so this would be stupid on his side let's just goblin barrel because uh, I mean goblins on the side because he tries to prevent the king tower activation and let's just recruit from the back another time the wizard doesn't get a hit unfortunately let's start from the back one more time I'm waiting for him to make some kind of mistake which for now he is not making to be honest so <laughs> well played by him um, here the mighty miner is actually dead he will hit everything but still it's not looking really great for him yeah, I predicted the princess this time. I don't know why. I, I was feeling that he would come, would come soon. Uh, all right, I was scared that the princess would kill all the recruits before they killed it, which it didn't happen. Um, I'm really finding it difficult to break through that mighty miner, to be honest. Uh, I'm not sure what to do. He gets a princess splash, unfortunately. Here I will need to snowball. That mighty Min miner will get distracted on the recruits, which is great. happen here he logs I'll just wizard let's just go all in here can't do much else no that's unfortunate uh, yeah I'm pretty sure this is the end not much to do against a bait tech to be honest yeah, Lumberjack goes, uh, runs away and it's in rocket range. So really unfortunate, he BMs for some reason, even though this was his matchup right from the start. But yeah, um, we will try one more game. Hopefully it goes a little better. We are in the third match. The opponent starts right off with the goblins. So yeah, we have one more deck with goblin hut. Great stuff. Let's just snowball here so that wizard dies, kills the egg, and also shoots the goblin hut. That was a great interaction. Um, I don't know, he's probably playing. Yeah, he's playing graveyard. Let's just play recruits. The rage of the uh, Lumberjack kills the, um, the goblins, so this is a clean defense. I don't really like having all the recruits on one side, to be honest, because he can put one splash card and kill everything. Yeah, he just uses rascals, and yeah, there's nothing I can do. Let's just go from the back. At least the rascal boy died there. Um, He has Goblin Hat in hand, but he doesn't have Rascals, which are like probably his best counter against the Loon. Oh yeah, he has also that. I forgot. But it may go on the tower. We get three. Oh no, only two. <laughs> two hits. Still quite good. I would have loved a third one, but what can you do? Um, 
the goblins should take care of everything. Yeah, great counter against the graveyard. And we are up in damage, which is great. Let's just use giant skeleton. Um, he will probably place a goblin hut in the middle. I will place the balloon on the side. Wizard. If he uses, yeah. Let's just use that, that. Uh, we don't get a hit, but still bomb damage, which is great. Let's just distract the Phoenix with the Lumberjack. No, unfortunately it died. So yeah, this is a dead push. Maybe even an overcommitment. I mean, not anymore. He used Goblin Hut, so it's fine. Alright, he uses Poison. Please, no, please, oh, so much damage there, no. I will probably need to stop the gen, the, the gen skelly on the bridge. Okay, there is no need to. No hits, unfortunately. I'm pretty sure here we are dead. I don't think we can defend. He will poison. The goblin need to put in work. All right. <laughs> we defend, but there is not much time left. It's just two poisons and we are dead. So we need to make something happen as soon as possible. Let's just Lumberjack in front to use the Rage to kill everything. Let's just Snowball. Oh yeah, let's go! Balloon on the tower! That was great. Like, the idea of getting the Lumberjack in front of the Gen Skelly to use the Rage to kill the Rascals. Yeah, we won, which is great. Um, that's definitely the best deck as of right now for the Ultimate. Champion League, so try it out. The Wizard is like top notch, as the best card you could play in the meta. And yeah, uh, that's it for the video. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next one.